I would like to quickly point out that John the Mouse video has a large selection of videos from North and South America for your viewing pleasure. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Now let's get into the cheese of the matter. This windmill was used to pump water, providing a much needed resource for many farm chores. With a wheel that is six feet in diameter, it can reach a maximum of 125 rotations per minute. They still make them today with a 100 ton punch to cut out triangular shapes from galvanized steel sheets. They'll need 18 triangular shapes for this wind wheel that are slightly bowed in shape from a roller. Windmill blades catch the breeze and spin while the gears convert to spinning action into pumping action. This technology has been around for over 2,000 years. Metal bladed windmills beat traditional wooden ones in its superior pumping capacity. Even in low wind conditions, it will turn with a greater force compared to one in wood the same size. take a crane to lift the 290 kilogram windmill to the top of the tower. This windmill should last decades pumping water. This X702 model was produced in Chicago in 1933. These windmills came in a variety of wheel sizes, some up to 20 feet in diameter. John the Mouse travel map is available for Google Maps. It will help plan your route to the locations of your favorite videos. It is free to use. I have the link below. Please visit the playlist tab for videos that I have sorted for you. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button